really quick. I'm kind of sad, but I'm excited. I hope y'all can hear me because the air is high, but it's so freaking hot in here. I gotta have this air crunk up and cool this house, this car off ASAP. I'm on my way to go get my baby from my aunt. I had her keep him for a couple hours this morning because I needed to take my computer, and this leads me to why I picked up the camera right now. I needed to take my computer to be fixed um, or looked at to see what needed to be fixed. I went to two locations and the second location, the prices are kind of kind of going to end up being the same, possibly. Um, I went to one brand, known brand computer repair, and their colors are orange and black. I will say that. And at a minimum, it was going to be like $150 for them. And um, they wanted it right then was the, probably the main thing. Uh, I'm honestly probably going to end up paying... Well, I know I'm gonna end up paying more than I thought I was gonna pay. Last time I had a different a different laptop other than the one I have now. And I've seen people on YouTube go to these, do these Dollar Tree hauls in these big Dollar Trees, look like big warehouses. Um, mine, anyway. So I'm about to go pick baby boy up while I'm already on this side of town. I have to come back to this side of town, unfortunately later to take my uh, power cord to the people. They checked my, I went ahead and just checked my laptop. At least they only wanted $80 today as opposed to 150 in a minute. So, uh, yeah. I think I'm, I'm, I'm excited, like I said. I'm gonna get over it. That was the, probably one of the most expensive parts of me getting my channel up and ready legit at this point getting the computer fixed. I was supposed to get it fixed a long time ago. Um, so yeah, I'm about to get baby boy as I stated a few times now. I'm on this windy, long, two-lane road to get him from my aunt, who is his babysitter. I need to get back on to looking into daycares for him. I want to call this one daycare in my area one more time. They didn't call me back before, and I don't like that when people don't follow up ever. Because it's like, if you don't answer the phone, and then you don't top of not answering the phone, you have a voicemail system, a voice message system, and you don't obviously check and follow up on the voice messages, it already gives me kind of a bad taste in my mouth about how your daycare may be unprofessionally run. But it is more like a child care. That's my thing. I don't I don't really want to send him to daycare. I do want him to interact with other kids and get those social things that he's gonna need. However, the social things that he might pick up from those other kids at the wrong type of daycare, where they're not really keeping them engaged in things that are productive or proactive and learning, stimulating wise, I think would be even worse than him you know, getting used to being around other kids. It's not like he's the only child either. While yes, there's not many kids around him his age, on the majority of faces, the majority of the time, why? I don't know why I do that. The majority of the time, I like over explain, overuse words. I need to get that together. He, did, he is around other people and um, other kids, children. That's why a lot of people think he's a lot older than he is. He is a little, I wouldn't say he's big for his age, because a lot of little kids I see, he's not bigger than them. Like, he's not. He actually looks small compared to a lot of kids his age that I see him physically just like walking around standing next to. But his behaviors and his mannerisms are indicative of like probably a two year old, a little bit over a two year old at times. Um, so yeah, he's a pretty whiny boy sometimes, but he is socially, uh, verbally communicating, communication wise, he is advanced. I need to get the education and the scheduling. He needs that in his life. That's why I believe in childcare and daycare. Even if we had the money where I could have stayed at home with him for his first five years or whatever, four years. Um, I probably would still have him in type of in some type of child care at least half part time because I think a lot of 
child care is obviously not just teaching them because yeah if I'm at home with them I can make sure I'm teaching them but it's the less structure honestly with the way our life is set up it might be different if our life is set up different and my goal and my job was to only you know be a stay-at-home mom it might be different he might still get that structure in the organization obviously but it's going to be a little bit more structured naturally because there's a one person or two people to a certain amount of kids and there's different reasons and concerns. It's, they're not at home. They're in a technically a third party environment. So I think the organization, the structure and the scheduling is a lot different, even if I was a, a stay at home parent. So yeah there's a lot of reasons i support child care i don't like the germs but also everybody needs a little bit of what's bad for them to make sure just enough of what's bad for them to make sure that they have an immune system just to make sure that things are balanced having zero contact with germs is not how you should live or are supposed to live naturally in the eyes of nature god and science it's not healthy to live with zero contact of germs because then you have your immune system has no strength because you didn't strengthen it you didn't build it up just like working out there's no reason for it to have any strength at this point so anyway let me go get my baby my aunt wants to show me some hair care stuff and probably ask me a thousand questions um i want to get through that as quick as i can only because i'm very thirsty i'm very hungry I'm very tired. I want to get some rest today, genuine rest. I have a lot of things I still need to do at home. Um, and I want to be able to rest. So I don't want to be here talking for an hour and a half. I want to go home, get my baby, go home, and then um, hopefully take a nap. I hope he hasn't took a nap yet, but he probably did. And get something to eat, which will probably be my, which not probably will be my first meal of the day. So love y'all. See y'all in a minute.